Hi guys, I'm back with another video. This is Meet My New Pet. Now, it was very unexpected and um, it didn't take long till I had him. He's currently, um, currently I'm fostering him. If I can find him another home, then I'll find him another home. If not, he's gonna live the rest of his life with me. Knowing, my, knowing me, uh, I'll keep him anyway. <laughs> so yeah, um, I'm gonna crack on with the video. So, hope you enjoy. Here he is. You just both see him. Hey, baby. His name is originally is Smokey. Now, Smokey is a long-haired Syrian hamster. I'm not too sure on um, color-wise, but he's like a brownie gray. He's got like a sapphire, sapphire, a silver color, and then he's got a lovely long skirt, which you can't really see. Now the reason why I'm I've taken them in is because the owners before they couldn't keep him because the dog kept the new new dog or the partner's partner's dog I believe um, didn't like him. And as you can see, he tries chewing through the hamster cage. Now obviously that'll stress your hamster, the hamster out, so she thought the best thing to do is put an ad up, and he was for free. And I thought, I can't even go because he's going to go into snake bait or some really bad owner. So I spoke to my mum about it and we ended up having him. So I'm not too sure on age, I'm sorry. Um, I will see if I can find out. But he's really, really big. I don't know if it's because he's um, a long head. I don't know if he looks bigger or what. But yeah, he's absolutely amazing. He's lovely, he's tame. Um, it looks like he sleeps in the tube. Because that's all he does is sit in his tube. But yeah, I'm going to crack on with what came with him. So Smokey lives in this, I believe it's a pick and mix range by Pets at Home cage. Now I've seen a lot, a lot, a lot smaller. This is still small for a Syrian. Now he's not staying in this, he's going in a tank like the boys. Um, I've got the tank ready, I just, um, it was actually like yesterday that it was official. So I hadn't got the tank ready and I had him today and I thought he'd be fine in this for a couple of days. But when I had him, obviously, it didn't have any of this in there. Nothing at all. And he's going to sleep. I'm guessing he sleeps in a tube. <laughs> so while he sleeps, I'll just show you around. Around. This is the cage, the purple one. It is broken on the other side, but that's fine. You won't be standing there long, like I said. It comes with these connectors. Um, these are both star connectors, so I don't think they go with the cage. But there's one there and one there. And I haven't taken the tube up because he really seems to like this tube. Oh, I'm so sorry. Sorry, baby. Um, but yeah, the other thing that is his is this bed. This is the bed he came with, oh, uh, no lid, it was just like this, but I'm guessing because he could not fit through there. I don't think he could anyway. Um, but it didn't come with this bed in. Um, he came with wood shavings on the floor. They gave me a large bag of that as well. Um, but I won't be using that. Let's keep it for emergencies. But inside here I've put the Wilkinson's bed in, the blue paper flake one. Now the boys don't like it. They do like it, but they don't tend to use it. They prefer to use a shredded to uh, tissue. So that's what I do with those. But that's just in there. The bed and the that we had was the dreaded fluff. Now I gotta be honest. Ugh, I can't stand the feel of it. I am surprised that this little hammy is still alive because everyone knows if, um fluff is not safe. Now you imagine just them swallowing this in their pouches and it can kill them. So um, if you're a new hamster owner, oh look out for more hamster videos as well now, just realised that. Um, if you're a hamster owner, don't buy this, buy this, or buy cheaper again, um, buy, um, I can't think what it's called, toilet paper and shred wrap, make sure it's not scented or coloured or anything like that. Just normal plain tissue, which I'll probably use for him because these probably get stuck in his... Uh, in his skirt. I think I mentioned his long head, didn't I? Yeah, I think I did. So yeah, that's the fluff that was inside his bed, which I've taken out straight away, because I don't like it. 
as for a wheel, because I wouldn't expect to have him, obviously Syrians need a, a really big wheel, I think it's like 12 inches they need. This is a, oh, what's it called? Flying saucer, but it's mainly aimed towards, I would say, oh, look at him. He's got on his side. He can't be very comfy, seriously. No. Oh, I'll leave him sleep. So I had this one for the boys um, when I first had those. You know, when I had um, a snow and storm, if you're no subscriber, then you will know. But I got a purple, a purple one, a blue one, and a green one of those. And I thought I wanted to get rid of the really hard because, as many hamster owners don't know, um, they can't have wheels that are too small for them because they can arch their back and I'm surprised. I'm surprised he hasn't his back went thin. So I'm guessing he's pretty young because he have not had no, well, I haven't seen no side effects of him. But I'll just put that one in for now until I can get hold of um, the big, uh, what's it called, rodent wheel to put in his tank. So that's that. I'll show you the wheel that he came with now. Here's the wheel. It's a, I believe it's a pick and mix range. Um, you must use it because it's got like scratch marks all over it. But yeah. Um, that's the wheel. I would say it's a bit bigger. I would say than Gizmo and Hayes's, and I can't remember the size of the ears. Oh my gosh, I can't remember. Is that noise the hammy? Sorry, I can hear like hiccuping or something. <laughs> um, so yeah, that was the wheel. The other thing that they had inside were these two pieces of bark. So that's a good thing I gotta give them that they did put. Um, chewable toys in there for them but these are new they have not been touched now if a hamster hasn't got any toys the first thing they chew is the wood as soon as they get hold of it now I would have thought because that's what's always happened but they haven't touched this I'm guessing these are new but I'll keep these for him because he has other toys now um, food bowl he has where's his food bowl in my hand this one pick mix range again I think Oh, says in the back. Uh, pick mix, pick and mix food bowl, oval purple. I can't say them for the bowl really. The bowl is a bowl, but I've changed the bowl as well to my spotty one, which I will give a little cage to her, which will be in another video. He came with these. I was going to read out of them. These um, sunflower seeds. I'm guessing he liked sunflower seeds. Um, but yeah, it seems he seems to like those. Came in the Chinese tub with food in there, which the food is this everyday hamster and gerbil muesli. Now I'm obviously I'm gonna get hold of Harry hamster and different mixes now for him. And I just can't wait to try all different treats out for him. Um with added vitamins, got peanuts, cereals, peas, beans, and sunflower seeds. All breed of hamsters and gerbils. Now I don't believe in a food that it can't be good enough if it's for hamster and gerbils, because I believe they got different um Different needs is the other thing to say. Personally, now the boys have got Jerry Gerbil and he will have Harry Hamster. Um, but yeah, that's the food and that's what it looks like. And I had a tub of it as well. I'd be changing, like I said, but for now i got to wean him off anyway. But that's what the food looked like. The other thing then came with was this water bottle. Now I'm guessing this is Pick, a Rain, pick a Mix again. I put a little bobble on there. If it'll focus, there we go. Little bobble on there because the bottle, bottle keeps falling. Now I've got plenty of spare bottles, but um, I don't know what he's like. Obviously, with drinking wise, if he finds it hard, so I don't want to change the spout or anything on it yet, just in case. So I'll be changing that shortly, but I won't be changing it yet if it makes any sense. But that's that. So yeah, that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I will do a more detailed one if you want me to, but I think it's just detailed enough. And he is fast asleep. Where's his eyes? There we go. Um, yeah. Oh, he's awake. I think. <laughs> I'm loving the owning a new hamster again. Hamster again. Since my boy's passed. But yeah. Hope you like him, guys. Oh, please leave name suggestions on the below. So if I do keep him, I will be naming him. Now, I quite like a few names. So, yeah. I will see you guys next time. And thanks for watching. Bye, guys. No.